to another video today i'm going to be doing some jamaican seasoned rice so for that i am going to be using i have over here some corn green peas and carrots um some chopped onions here this is some green seasoning that i prepared um there's some salt fish that i um washed and shred and i have some cooked ackees over there i have some green onion thyme some bolon herb and pepper right there and i'm going to be using some coconut oil um, to saute my vegetables and my ackee so i hope you enjoy this video as we go along okay so right here i have some oil in the saucepan already and i am going to be adding my green seasoning i forget to tell you that i'm going to be using some coconut milk also and water so i'm just releasing the flavor from this and then i'm going to be adding the onions You can chop the onions smaller than this, but this is okay for me because in the green seasoning there is onion already. And please do this on a low flame or your herbs will burn and you will not like the taste. So I just added the corn, carrot, and green peas. Now this is really fresh carrots. It's not tin carrot. And the corn is fresh sweet corn. I boil it and then remove the, the greens from the cob. Um, this is tin green peas. You can use all tin products if you want to, but I choose to use some fresh products and prepare them nicely. So I'm going to cover this a little bit just to get the flavors in and then I'll continue with the rest of the recipe. So I'm going to be adding the salt fish now to this. You can add more salt fish if you want and then two cubes of bouillon. To this, I'm going to add some water and I will put the measurements in the description box. Some more because I'm going to be adding the coconut milk to that. I'm also adding the herbs. Let's adjust the flavor now, turn it up a little bit more because I need to bring this to a boil. I'm adding the coconut milk at this point. And this is just lovely. So this I'm going to add thyme and the green onion. So that's some thyme green onion and I'm going to cover this and allow it to boil all right guys so the coconut milk and all the herbs and spices smells really good this is what it looks like so far 
So I'm going to be adding the ackee now. I'm not going to take this out as yet. If you want, you can do that, but I'm just leaving it in there for a while. So I'm going to be adding the ackees, and the ackee is already cooked. this in a little bit I already washed my rice I'm using basmati rice you can use whatever rice you have this is what I have today so that's what I'm using and this smells really good guys so I'm gonna be adding my rice now And you will have to adjust your flame once you put the rice in because you really don't want the rice to burn. So I'm just combining everything. And I'm going to cover. It's so like a little bit of like too much water, but it's really not a lot of water. It's just gonna dry out guys so this is what the rice looks like I'm going to fluff it up a little bit but I'm going to remove these first and this is cool so I'm just gonna fluff it up and turn off the flame guys when you're cooking the rice once the water evaporates you're going to turn the flame down to low so that your rice can steam slowly. Use a tightly covered lid. Can't you see it? Tony, I know. You always want to yes. And this looks lovely. Like, really lovely. So this is the season rice guys if you like the video don't forget to give it a thumbs up share and subscribe